Alright, what's going on everybody? It's Chris and welcome to another edition of My Crazy Crossroads. C's Crazy Crossroads, Triple C for short. I'm here with Big Joey C from Urban Ghost, Urban Exploration, and once again, Todd from the Holy Walkers. We are at a cemetery, mausoleum, and something else is going on. They were telling me somebody with a pitchfork killed like 700 people or something back over here and we're going to go check it out. Why not? We're nuts. Follow us. After this, we're going to also come back and do another 30-minute challenge, of course. Hopefully, we don't get shot at this time. We'll see what happens. See you soon. I got to say, this place is absolutely beautiful, though. But it's my first time in a cemetery at night, so let's see what happens with that. I can't imagine there being any spirits in a uh, cemetery. That would make no sense, right? Oh, it's so beautiful. I haven't seen it yet, but it, I see the sign saying there's a chapel. Yeah. Oh, this is so beautiful. Yeah. Oh. So we're heading back now. I think one of the first things. This is so beautiful, and I just pray that everybody's at peace here, including us. Yeah, that's another thing. Joe found a Ouija board when he was out here last time. And uh, <laughs> if you guys didn't hear that, Joe said right back here behind this fence is where the quote unquote pitchfork killer's house is. So why not get as close as we possibly can to that guy's house? Oh, that's okay, that's Todd. And this is right in the area where I thought I heard somebody say, come here. Oh, yeah, you'll hear lots of stuff. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. All right, so we're going in. We're going in where? We go that way. Okay, okay. I'm not just going back that way. I'm going to follow you. Right. Okay, you guys go right ahead. We're going in for a... <sighs> Wore shorts for this. Yeah, I did. I wore shorts. I know when I'm coming back, I'm wearing jeans, that's for sure. And I'm not coming back here for my 30 minutes. Oh my goodness. What? Yeah, way more overground over the last Oh man. Oh my. Alright. Who was that? Did you hear that? That, that really sounded like another gunshot. That's great. No, there's a bark. You hear the dogs? <sighs> hey, are we really going all the way back here? Yeah. I just heard something. I swear to God. <clears throat> What's that? No, I heard laughing. I heard laughing. Yes. All right, come on. Let's. What's going on now? I heard laughing too. Let's go do it, Chris. You got this. Man. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's fireworks back there. Okay. Why is it? Why are we doing this? I mean, we've got this whole beautiful cemetery we can be going through. Oh, my God. Is that? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? This guy's house? Oh, my goodness. There's a shack back here. Oh, my 
goodness gracious. When you want to live right here behind the Now the story is with this place is that the guy lived here and killed his family with pitchfork. And this is the remains this. of that very house. So in case you guys didn't hear that, Joe said this is the remains of the pitchfork killer's house. But it looks like a shack, or just a little shed. Yeah. You can see where there was like a chimney. Oh, that's a bathtub there. Yeah, you can see there was like a chimney there. Yeah. I mean, most of the house is gone. There's a shed back there. This is not. So it's connected to the cemetery itself. I wonder if he was like a crypt keeper or something. What is that? What is that? That sounded to me like an animal. Oh gosh, it makes sense. I don't want to run into any animals out here. I'm okay with running into. Oh yeah, there is. There's a fireplace. Up ahead. Oh hell yeah, we gotta do lights out back here. Oh come on. No we don't. We really don't have to do lights out back here, Joe. Watch his step, man. Yeah, I, I don't feel comfortable back here at all. <clears throat> this is the bathroom. My foot's finally healing up. And now I'm gonna Careful step on a pitchfork. Watch that nail. Look at that nail on that board there. Joe, you got to be really careful because we're going to step on another nail. Yeah. Yeah, it's really safe. You'll see when you walk on. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, so this is it. This is the remains of this place. I mean, this is all that's left. So this was a bathroom right here. The bathtub, you can see the medicine cabinet. Oh. See, what I'm most concerned about is the woods. <laughs> yeah, guys, I don't, I don't feel comfortable standing on this stuff, man. This doesn't feel safe to you? No. And I don't want to get anything in my foot again. And Or in your hand. Watch, Joe. Look at all the nails sticking out. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I'm, I'm going to head back. Another way, because... This way, it's only the way. Oh, this is the only way. Oh, okay. Yeah, Joe, let's not let it fall on us, buddy. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm going to try to get around this. I don't know if there's a way to get around this. you got to step on that. Joe, I can't, I can't climb on that, man. You gotta come. Well, that's the whole job. Yeah. Thanks. Gotcha. Yeah. Uh, you want me to help you? Yeah, it's dangerous. Watch the nails in the wall. Yeah, I'm gonna tell people why I can't. Chris walk just like nailed that. it. Later on. Yeah. So do you know what year this happened? Um, I don't know. It's in the article. I guess we're going to post it in the video. We'll po we're going to post the article in the video of the Pitchfork Killer for you guys to read about. Watch your head, Joe. <laughs> I know, right? Definitely not laughing. Uh, no. Well, this reminds me like a shit inside my backyard. Okay, here's old, an old shed. Yeah, we get eaten by mosquitoes, man. Yeah, we gotta bring some uh, off out here. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't think of that beforehand. <laughs> I 
did something that sounded like that, like somebody breathing, like making an exhale. Oh. Heavy exhale. <laughs> you hear? I, I heard, heard something say. like that. Oh, you heard say? <laughs> Thought. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna. Hey, listen, ever since I started this, all I do is hear things now. So I don't know if it's real. I think we should do a lights out. Sure. Lights out. That's a great, what a great idea that is. Yeah. Lights out. No, you're absolutely <laughs> lights out of your friggin' mind. Then let's do it. Yeah. Oh, sure. All right. You hold my hand. Yeah, that's how wild the house is way over there now. Okay. We're in the middle of the woods. It's almost 2.30 in the morning by now. Hey, look at the dingleberries hanging. Look at those. Perfect. The dingleberries? Yeah, look at that. It looks like they were strategically placed. Yeah, I'm okay. Uh, I just don't really know where to stand if we're going to do a lights out challenge. Cause... Oh, I heard something. <sighs> too. I heard something over there as well. Oh my God. Lights out, guys. We're okay. in the middle of the woods. Wait for lights out. Okay. Oh, waiting for me. Okay, you sure. Sure, okay. We're going lights out. Yeah, let's do this. All right, if there's any spirits here, go talk to Chris. Please stop. Chris, not shut up. Let's see, I really freaking heard something. Please say something if you hear. Oh, you know what, guys? We forgot to pray. Why don't we pray and then shut the lights out? You want to do that? <laughs> <laughs> Let's do that. A little prayer. We just need right. one last day. Let's do this. So I'll join Pray. hands in prayer. All right. Jesus Christ, you are our Savior. Heavenly Father, we ask for your protection. It's through you, Jesus Christ. We know all things are possible. Please protect us. Please also protect everybody who watches this video. Amen. Yeah, me too. <laughs> all right. All right. Guys, one, two, three, lights out. Okay, we're going to do lights out because we're just Smart. really stupid. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Breathing? It might have been me. Yeah, I heard. Oh. What the fuck was that? Okay, seriously. On a motorcycle scanner. <laughs> Alright, man, let's let's move back a little. Can we move back? Step back a little because it sounds like something's right there. You hear that? If you're a spirit and you want to come towards us, come towards us now. You hear the voice? Oh! Oh! Dude, what was that? Sounds like I'm here or something. Huh? Can we go back up? There's something there. Whoa. Whoa. Come okay, on. come on. Let's go back on, Joe. Just try not to move from where you... Oh, something touched the back of my head. Joe, I'm literally right here. Okay. All right, wait. Okay. I'm going back to back with you, buddy. Yeah, stay close, guys. in the back of my head. <clears throat> it did it again. It sh my, my video shut. I just put it back on. Shit. Okay. You 
freaking hear that. Are we lights on? Let's. Can we seriously yeah. get out of here? Can we please get? Can we please just get out of here, please? I mean, I, I, this is cool and everything. I don't mind doing your lights out game, but over here, man, oh man. Joe, can I get in front of you? Yeah, thanks, buddy. Appreciate that. Because it's it's not good. I gotta put my light back. My light went on and then came off. Yeah, there's. Didn't it sound like something was walking over here? Yeah. Watch your watch where you're stepping, buddy. <clears throat> oh boy, I don't. I'm gonna need your help again, Todd. Cause uh. Should I tell everybody about my disease? I never mentioned it. <sighs> What's up to you, bro? I mentioned in the last video that I'm not the most agile person around. Um, I have a very rare disease. Um, it's called CFS, cramping fasciculation syndrome, and it's extremely rare, so they have nothing to compare me to. Um, I was originally diagnosed with ALS, Lou Gehrig's disease, and I was given three to five years to live, and that was five years ago. And it was with my strong faith in God that got me through. Um, I told all my doctors when I was diagnosed how grateful I was because I felt I took it from someone else, and I was able to deal with it myself, and I knew I would beat it. So with that being said, they now say it's CFS. It could also be PLS, which is primary lateral sclerosis, same thing as ALS, same syndromes, all that good stuff. But anyway, if you see me a little wobbly or needing a little assistance on certain things, that's why. I'm not saying this to, for anybody to go, I feel sorry for you or whatever, because I'm fine. Um, just a little slower at doing certain things. But that being said, I'm going to go back to getting freaked out. But can we get out of this little yeah, area here? Because I know yeah, there's a lot more to explore here. And yeah. This... <clears throat> Pete the pitchfork guy. So pitchfork and eaten by mosquitoes. I'm not coming back here on my alone challenge, buddy. <laughs> not back there. No way. I can't. I can't climb back there anyway. Yeah. See, now I got a good excuse for everybody <laughs> not to do things. <laughs> I can't. I can't do it. I don't want to. And this is not a good thing. Oh, oh! It just stuck me, yeah. Hey, what is that, a cornhole board? They were like, I think they were like storage. <laughs> yeah, it's not a cornhole board. That's some rugged terrain over there, boys and girls. I never thought I'd say I feel so much better to be in a mausoleum, <laughs> right? Yeah. All right, guys, we just took a little five-minute break. It's so hot out here. Um, it's, it's definitely creepy just being in this area at night. I've never been in a cemetery at night, but being back in the woods was definitely uh, strange. Outside of that, everything seems pretty calm, and hopefully it stays that way, but... We'll see what we get into. Very calm. I think yeah. this is the the nicest feeling I've had. It's very. It, I feel like I'm in a dream sense. Like, where's the water? I hear water. Yeah. I hear a waterfall. Please forgive me, guys, if I'm getting names. On here again, definitely don't mean any disrespect to these families. I hear water. There's water like right over here. Hey. What? What's the matter? It's resting. Water. <laughs> For some reason. And we've walked quite a ways. And we've been hearing a waterfall. And it's just, we're heading up this way. 
and I believe there's a waterfall or fountain or whatever over here. But I'm actually a little worried about Big Joey C. Big, tough Joey C. He's just acting a little strange. So, seems alright right now, but it's so hot out here and I'm worried about one of us getting dehydrated too. So, we just need to watch out for each other and get through this. That's the lake. I'm telling you it's here, but time. This is, I guess, a, a time measurement thing? I don't know. What is this? If anybody knows what this is. This is some kind of sundial, maybe? I don't know. No. It's got, like, Roman numerals on it. Oh, it looks like a an arrow shooting out of... Oh, yeah, that's got to be something to tell time, is right? Is an arrow? No, that's not. It's time. It's all in Roman numerals. Yeah, it's so weird. It's pretty like, neat. Cool. I'm telling you guys that you gotta get to the water and it's not too far. Feel like, uh, feel like Twilight Zone, Joe. Like we went to another dimension. That was incredibly strange. Wow, look at that. Oh. It almost looks like some kind of weird, like, symbol, right? Wow, look at that. I don't know. There's a lake over here. What's that? And a house, yeah. Across the lake. You good? This is like the three, like the Trinity, right? Like Maybe. That's what it reminds me of. Oh, yeah, look at the lake. It's over here. Clockwise, but then it's counterclockwise at the same time. Did you left, still right and right, right, left? Forget is it upside down, is it right side up. But there's a lot of them, you know. Three times they have it. It's always good to know that, no matter what. No. All right, guys. 4:30 in the morning. We're almost out of here. Uh, Joe and Todd were freaking out towards the end. I think they got some water in their system. They're back to it. But uh, this was really beautiful. This was uh, definitely not uh, a creepy place to where I was freaking out. If you guys were looking forward to me going crazy and running around, running away like a scared little girl, uh, I don't think it happened. But uh, definitely a mixture of emotions here. Um, very surreal, but just an awesome, awesome feeling to be out here tonight. But uh, with that being said, thank you for checking out this video tonight, and uh, stay tuned for the next one. Oh, by the way, we, uh, we've decided we just most likely are not going to come back right away for our 30-minute challenge. Uh, I think because Big Joey C couldn't handle it. But he's back. I got this. Look at him. Ooh, he's yeah. dressed. Yes. Peace.